and from the video, some of you were able to tell me how those people must be what were those reasons that led those people to the group. So for the purpose of today's class, just as I told you that day, that we'll be looking at it critically, what and how, all reasons that make some people to join court, we'll be looking at it critically today. Last week was to get a feedback from you based on what you have seen. But today we are going to dig deep into this. And for your information, our class on Friday will not hold because Friday is public holiday. Hmm? Friday is public holiday. That is a democracy day, June 12th. So we need to work on some things here today. And let's see how it goes. We, there are some things that are not actually what alien to you in this perspective. And I say alien, there are something you already know as regard the uh, courtism and why people join courts. From the image you are looking in this PowerPoint, this is several, we have some several students writing exam here. If you look at the, the, the students behind the one at the front here, what is it doing? Define, tell me, what is it doing? He's looking clueless. What, 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 the way he's looking, Joshua, you are excited. The way he's looking, what does it tell you? He doesn't know what to write. He doesn't know what to write. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. And I'm still with you. I'm still with you, Joshua. I will soon come to you. Now, if a student who does not know what to write and he has paid school fees and he knows that if he fails, he's going to repeat that class and he's not ready to do the necessary study, what do you think that kind of student will do? He'll cheat. He'll cheat, right? And he, yeah. if he engages in cheating and he is caught, do you know what it means? Like university, when you are when when a person is caught, is rustication, or in most cases they may suspend the student for a while, depending on the gravity of the offense. Now he knows that if he cheats, he will be rusticated. What other means do you think that the student will engage in? Because steal papers from the lecturer. Okay. Okay. What I'm trying to ask. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you very much, uh, Divine. I love that. Okay, now, well, looking at it, he knows that if he is engaged in cheating, he will be caught. And if he is caught, he's going to go for it. Then, in most cases, and it's not ready to do the serious work for him you know, to pass. He may decide to go and join the court. He, would, he doesn't want to work. What he just, what he just had to do is that. To find a means of threatening lecturers, hmm? threatening teachers that oh, we just pick a call. Hello, is that Mr. Emmanuel? Yes, this is Pajuro. Pajuro from your class, you know your class. You know you are the one taking maybe as me maybe a civic education, right? You see, that exam we are writing tomorrow. I don't know anything. I don't know anything. And sir, hmm? for the interest of your family and the children you have, you know they are still young. I, I must not fail the exam more. If I fail the exam, let me tell you. I know where you are staying. You stay in GRA, Noba Streets, Komola Street. Hmm? Number six, that is where you stay. You have three children. Your wife is fair in complexion. And this is the number of your car. And this is the number of your wife, the number, the number of the car that's your, the, the number plate of your wife's uh, car. They will give you details about yourself. You'll be afraid 
Okay, okay, okay. At that point, you see that, okay, okay, okay. What do you want me to do for you? I, I'm a, I must not fit the subject or I must not fit the course. That is why I said in this place, academic weakness. Some students are weak academically and they are not ready to do the needful. And the next thing for them to do is to engage themselves in a secret society on which they will use the platform to threaten lecturers or teachers in order for them to award them on due marks. And that is why you see the society today. We have so many graduates that cannot write a page of letter. Some, if they should write a letter for you, you will vomit. Okay, there are many. This is a situation, though we have other aspects that produce this, uh, this, this, this kind of graduates. We have some that sell their body in order to get the, the, the certificate. And when they get society, they become useless. So one major of it is through this means. Some people are lazy. That is why we encourage you here to work so that God, will not, God forbid that something like that will happen that you will, somebody will not tell that, ah, that uh, course, they are chemistry 101. Ah, you fail it. Ah. If you join us, you will not fail that course. If you have studied, that kind of friend will not come to you to give that kind of advice. Exercise what I call seriousness, diligence in everything you are doing so that a friend that shouldn't have come to you will not come to you. Because it's out, it's, it's out of this challenge at times. It's a lot of the challenge at times that you see people coming to uh, some students. You know, when somebody's while he said and thinking in the classroom, what is wrong now? I paid that course, that uh, course taught by Professor uh, Saddam. Hmm? So, uh, like, are you paid that course? Ah, if you know the way now, you pass now. You can come and you can come and see us. But if you have been serious, if you know what to do, if you know what to do, if you have been serious, you will not find yourself in that kind of uh, kind of disastrous conditions where unwanted friend will come to you to get you into trouble. I think that is very clear. Yep. You can see from this picture now, you see, you see a man, a big man there. Uh, I'm going to Ezefla now. Ezefla, where are you? Yeah, thank you, Ezefla. I can see you here. You can see the man there. That man you see. I'm here, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That man you see, what, what his attitude, what does it tell you? Um, that, um, um, please, that, please um, like, the parent, um, is a parent that is trying to, like, um, um, influence the children no, into no, joining no, 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 calls. No, 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 you have not answered the question. You have not answered the question. Anybody? Okay, divine. Okay, Pussy, you are excited. I will recognize you. Yes. You're saying that the man is mad. He's mad. <laughs> Okay, the man is not mad. <laughs> Let me listen to Posse. Posse, where are you? Okay. Posse, you have the floor. It's showing, it's showing that the man is a, a wizard or is in a cult. Thank you very much. Olajimo, okay, you are excited. I received your response. Thank you very much. Okay, something said that it showed that that man must be a cult. No, no ordinary human being does not engage in this kind of thing. That is just the truth. Now, assuming the man is the chief herbalist, just like Olaj Moke said, most of these herbalists, they are, they are occultic people. And he's old enough, he's going. Don't you think that he, don't, he will not want his, uh, that, 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 that is a spiritual circle to die with him, right? He would want somebody like a child of his that will stand, be, stand in for him when he might have gone. So what I'm, what I'm saying in the sense of this is that there are people that don't, they don't see anything wrong in being a cult, being a cultist, I mean. 
if a parent is a courtist, you should be less assured that the parent, one way or the other, will not say anything wrong for his or her child to join a court. And by doing, by doing, you will see that some, some even encourage them that come and do this thing, come and do this so that you take after me. Let me, let, let me go out of a court, a brief. If your father owns a business, if your father owns a business and the father is getting old and he was unable to go to work as usual, and he's the CEO of the, of the company, don't you think that your father will want to transfer the CEO to you one day? Especially if you are the first one and you are serious? Uh, Taylor, am I saying the truth? Yes, sir. He wants you to continue where he stopped. The same way it applies to all these courtists. What they do is that in most cases, they, 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 they encourage their children to take after them. Since they are courtists, they, 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 they want to encourage them. They want them to take after them, especially when they have a, a high rank in the spiritual world where they belong. So this is one of the reasons some students or people join courts because of the influence from their parents, since, since there's nothing wrong about it, since their parents are courtes and they don't say anything bad about it, if my father could be a court, I can also be a court. As with some of you, and your fathers are pastors and pastor misses. You want to take after them, the same thing that happened to the parents that are courtes. I think that is self-explanatory. By looking at reasons, students or people join courts. Yeah. Poverty. This one, without, say, without saying anything, you have already seen. Look at those children as scavengers. Those scavengers. I think uh, some of you last week, you heard about the lady that ran away from, um, far away from Abel Puta. What made him have to run away? Let me hear from somebody here. What made her to run away from Abel Puta? Temidiri. Eh? She want, she needed money. Money because the parent, if you from the back, from the way she talked, he's come from a very poor background. Poor past. Hmm? That is why she has decided to run away to run away from uh, Lake, uh, Abel Kuta and come to Lagos. Look at this set of children now. They, in fact, they are in my area here. Yes, if you, at time when I when I'm walking through this, I look at the way some children live. I, I have pity for the country. I have pity for Lagos State because these children, as you look at them, they are potential courtists. One way or the other, they want to survive tomorrow. And in the press of trying to survive, they won't mind to engage in any activities that is detrimental to the peace and progress of the society in order to get their living. Most people, all this armed robber you have seen, you do see, robbing banks. If you listen to news some days ago, see the one, the, the one that happened in Kogi State. Keep people, keep police, keep, you, you start. Most, most of the armed robbers, they graduated from courtes, courtes, as in they are courtes. So when poverty, eh, extreme poverty, rain, in a particular society. In order to make a living and survive the hardship imposed on the people by poverty, some people may decide to engage themselves in a scrupulous activity that will enhance their means of making money, like what we have seen here. So I appeal. At the same time, because it is poverty in most cases, or for the fact that maybe at a point in time you, the person is poor, it's not a yastic for and make somebody to enjoy to, to, to join courts. There were people that were poor before, but today they are rich. Okay? There were people that were somehow poor, poor, but today they are what? Rich. You don't need to be a courtist. I'm talking about it is possible for you to. Mm, something may not be working well. You may be in university. You may not be driving car. Your colleagues may be driving car. 
please don't go ahead of your time. This is how some people join court on campus. They are friends, they'll be using iPhone. Uh, iPhone what now? Which one is the latest? Let me let Divine tell me. Which one is the latest? 12. Up to 12, I'll be a hand. Maybe your friend are yes, using yes. Uh -huh, anyone. Your friend are using, and maybe you, you are using one Palasa phone. Hmm? Yeah, you know Palasa, now you know that kind of, uh, you, you want to feel along. Ah, that is, I didn't know my friend. See the way they do in the class. See the way they, this time. You, when you are too inquisitive at times, you may run, you may, you fat, you may put yourself in trouble. So please, be satisfied with what you have. Because there are some people, not that they are actually poor, but they are not of the, you know these fingers, they are not what equal. Look at your finger the same way. You can't compare yourself with your colleague. Yes, look at the finger, they are not equal. Understand? You can't compare yourself with your colleague. Be satisfied whatever your parent gives to you. Don't because you need a car, your colleagues had. When I was in university, so many of my friends were driving car. A stand. So many of them, even age I'm, 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 I'm older than them. But I don't care. That is their own. Why some are legitimate, some are not legitimate. So please be satisfied with what you have in order for you not know, to be law into courtesy. Okay? Poverty is one of the reasons some people decide to join court because they, are, they think that they can actually make money. But go and ask. I many people that have made the money through that if they enjoy the money for money to eat me. If they enjoy the morning, in the evening, in the, in the afternoon, their life will get born. Go and ask. So please, don't get any illegitimate money. Get legitimate money. Money that God will see you and say, my son, you have done very well. Another one is defense or security. In most, this one, of course, is, is very common. A stand. Let me come through the family level now before I go in detail into this. There are some of you, your brother, maybe, maybe your brother has offended you, beat you one day. Next time when your brother wants to beat you again, you will go and devise a means that if you beat me today, I will, I will use this thing to hammer him. Hmm? It happens. It's happening in most cases. Really, those people you are struggling as for supremacy, even among friends. In most cases, though there are some people that are legitimately as in, treated as, in, as, as, as animal. Hmm? Look at the picture you see here. This is a law enforcement agent in Nigeria. This is a Nigerian. Irrespective of the offense this guy might have committed, doesn't deserve to be treated in this way. He's a Nigerian. He's supposed to be arrested and be treated as human being and be taken to court for any offense. But a man that you are dragging on the floor like this, a, a, a harmless human being, a person that does not carry arm. If this man escaped this kind of uh, turbulent uh, treatment, don't be surprised that he can decide to go and find a solace in a court whereby he will be able to take pound of flesh from those people that have maltreated him. That is in that perspective in that society. In the schools, it's happened. Some lecturers, they treat the, uh, the students as if they are animals. Some, for a gay, you, maybe you are very close to a gay and they want to date that gay. They, they think that maybe you are dating that gay or maybe you are actually dating the gay. Because of that, they will treat you like a trash. And you know they are lecturer, you are, a, you are a student. And some people look at it that because of this, I, I need to defend myself and get this man. In order for me to do this, eh? Uh, Maybe the process of discussing it. If some friends will give suggestion, I come and if we join this group, eh? if we join a year, eh? I will organize our guys with treat his fuck up. And is that true? He will go and join. Hmm? He will go and join. But let me just tell you. Oh, uh, those are most of majority of you are Christians, right? God says something. What does God say about vengeance? Yes, who is telling me? Yes, yes. Okay, some hands are up. Let me see those have raising their hands. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, are you here? Yes, vengeance is mine. 
Invergence is mine. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Omoto Show. Hmm? So you are excited. The rest of you are excited. It shows that the majority of you are good Christians. You attend Sunday school. That is good. Okay? God said, vengeance is what? Mine. Okay? What am I saying? Is that, okay, thank you very much, Divine. Okay? What I'm saying, in a sense, is that you don't need to join the courts in order for you to have been for yourself. It is God that has been for his people. Why are you doing that creator yourself? Why do you have to join a court in order for you to take vengeance from somebody that has or don't want to know that against you? Let me tell you, my brothers and sisters, if God eh, should fight on your behalf, you will see beg God, say, God, please, hmm? please, God, leave him alone. It's enough. I'm telling you, time will not permit me. I'm not teaching you CRS here to go some aspects in the Bible for you. So, please, that for defense, for security, for anything, you don't need to join the court. Allow God to fight for you. Thank you. Yeah. Can you see? You see, I have to say ego, ego or fame. Hmm? No, there are some of you. It's some, there are some of you who say, there are some now they want to do it. See that? I want to feel, I want to be, I want to feel alone. Hmm? I want you to know that, yes, I one of the boys on campus. Let me tell you, Joshua was popular in the Bible. Was he a courtist? The answer is no. Moses was popular. Was he a courtist? The answer is no. Baba Tundi Raji Fashola was a former governor of Lagos State and a minister now. If he had been a courtist, he would not be able to be a governor. Okay? Professor Yemi Simbaju would have been the vice president of Nigeria if he is a courtist. But they are popular. Hmm? I did not know. They are known. So please, for any reason, please, some students have adduced them themselves in order for them to, uh, they want to be popular, they want to be, they want to be among the best, they want to earn respect from where they don't even have any quality. If you look at, by the time we are joining a couple people here that uh, I'm a member of AYE, mm. they will say, Babao. Mm. I'm a member of AYE Confraternity. People will say, people, they, they will do champagne for me, they will forget about it. Those things does not last just for a while. Any respect that is not legitimate, any ego or fame that is not legitimate, don't go for it. Go for those ones that are legitimate. Thank you. Um, you can see rape. Of course, majority of you know what is happening in society now. Hmm? You know what is happening in the society. You can see the lady here and the picture you are seeing. The lady that was raped, why he, she went, a 100 level student of the uh, University of Benin, raped, why she went to study in a, in a church. Let me not mention the name of the church now. Understand? Okay. And why she was there. That's, you know, it's only courtesies that do that kind of thing. Animal. It is animalistic behavior for you to just say, who might be a lady, and yeah, you want to rape her. What will you derive? Rape and use fire extinguisher to hit her head. You can see the fire extinguisher down there to the blood. What has he achieved now? The rape, which is not a consensual relationship. I don't think you will do it more than five minutes. That five minutes will end him eternal damnation. That is hell. And the person will suffer and because he'll be arrested and he's going to be killed. So why? Why will you use why will you use because of a food in the backhand here and throw away the one that is here? When you put food here and you put one here, which one will contain more food? It's the one here, not here. If you have engaged yourself in a good industrious work and other thing, when it is time you get married, you have access to why raping? Hmm? So some students join court groups in order to rape prominent or beautiful girls or women on campus, especially those ones that have turned them down. So I have turned them down, they felt that, hey, you turn me down, I will show you. Hmm? But if you show her, 
you rape her, what will you benefit? This is one of the reasons that some guys join cult group. And if you look at all these reasons, I want to hear from you. Looking at all these reasons, which of the reasons do you think that it is justifiable? All the reasons, which one do you think that is justifiable, that you can justify? Yes, uh, uh, Amato Shaw. Well, the one I think that is justifiable is, is because of defense. It's not if you use it for hello, defense. Man. Hello, guy. Eh? You are thank God you were doing the answer my question the other time. What does God say? Eh? What does God say about vengeance? Is mine. Uh -huh. So what are you telling me? Now, vengeance is mine. So why just? No, not that to attack the person. No, like not that to attack the person. Hello. Like let's say that Hello. Want to attack you. Hello, later. guy. Calm down. Thank you very much, uh, Olajimoke. Thank you very much. No one. Olajimoke responded that there's no one that is justifiable. There's no one you can justify. That's just the truth. There's no one you can justify. The reason is that. You want to take? Can you can you avenge for yourself? No, that, that that's how it's no. It's only God that can avenge for you. Okay, divine, you raise your hand. Um, so wow. what about parental influence? Jesus. Parental because influence. Because some of them, it can actually be forced. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much. You said parental influence, and it can actually be forced at times. If you look at the parent too, eh? the parent is also a problem to the society. You understand? The, the, the challenges we are having in society today, that's a result of what? Poor parenting. Poor parenting. If, a fa if, if the head is bad, what will happen to the rest of the body? It will be bad. So that is that in regard of what you have just said. It's still not legitimate. They will be forced, fine. But you can also, you might have seen at times too that a parent that wants to coerce the child to, to do something that is not lawful, and the child will run away. Say, no, daddy, I will not do this. Mom, I will not do this. Let me give for instance. I, I, I think I have read in this paper before you see a, a, a child that the parent wants her to marry at maybe at the age of 13, and she has to run away from home. Today is a global citizen. She is a global citizen. Hmm? The same thing happened. If your parent wants you to do something that will not give the society a good name, that will not give yourself a good name, that will not make you to be acceptable before your creator, that is almighty God, you have to disobey that parent. I said it, quote me. Parents are just what? Guardians. You, are, you belong to God. And you are expected to be trained in line with the will of God. But if that parent will now go ahead to train you otherwise, based on the principle that is something that is contrary to the principle that God has given, then at that point, that parent needs to be disobeyed. But get me very well. Get me very well. I'm not saying you should disobey your parent, but what I'm saying is that if a parent wants you to go and do something contrary, to the principles of God, to something that will make your life positive. And I know none of you here, the students I have here, there's no student here that have such a parent. Yes, because I know your parents. That directly or indirectly. Yes. Don't, I don't have such parents here. So please, and please, if you are forced to come and do something that is wrong, say no to it. Ivan, I have answered that question. Okay, so I have said it that none of this is legitimate because of the fact that all those things you have said, God is able to do them for you. How many of you, by the way you think, by the way you talk, that can add an atom, maybe you add a second to your life? If you say you want to join the court, you want to take vengeance, you want to fight for yourself, what if in the process of joining that court you die? Yes. What if that parent that said you should join the court to take after him when he died? When he died, maybe what if you die before the parents, before the father? Yes, it is how it happened. A child can die after the before the father. 
What if that girl you say you want to rape? And the process of trying to rape that girl, you join the court because the girl turned you down, you want to rape her. And your man who refused to come up. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. You see, God is God is wonderful. Yes. Don't try God though. Don't try God. You have seen some people that want to make money. Okay? They join court because they want to make money. Some will use their part of it, some will use their child. Yes, they will not make that money. The price of at the at the apogee, at the apex of trying to make that money, something will happen and they will die. They lose in this world and they lose in eternity. So there's none of these reasons, there's none of these reasons legitimate. There's nothing you need. Are you weak academically? What does James, the book of James? Was it James? I'm sorry, I don't know. Who is the Bible student here? That's, if you like wisdom, is it James? Or proverb, or what? I'm not sure. Understand? But those of you are Bible students here, you understand? You understand? If you lack wisdom, where, 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 where do you go to? You go to God. Eh? Let me share my whole testimony with you. In most cases, when I was investing, some, some of my colleagues do look at me that I may, maybe I, I have something special that I use. Not even university, alone in secondary school. I do pray to God, anything I want to do. If I want to study, I will pray first. God, let me, give me that spirit of concentration. Okay? Then direct anything, anything I study, don't allow me to forget. And if I'm going to class, I pray. Whatever the teacher will teach today, anything, I want to learn very well. In most cases, I don't, I don't, you know, when you are with God, you don't need to stress yourself too much. Because God is working for you. Little effort like this will yield something great. The problem people have is that they have neglected God, their creator. And that is why they are struggling, trying to find some ways of getting some things right for themselves. So there's no reason you should join a court. Look at all those reasons. There's no one that is legitimate. There are many others. In our next class, by God's grace, before I go to the consequence of courtesy, by God's grace, next week is the first Friday will not have class. I'm going to give you some kind of question from WhatsApp. Okay, we're going to look at the question side by side. Although one of them will be my assignment for this week. Okay, I want to test your own method, your own understanding. Then we're going to look at them. When you see those questions, how you're supposed to answer them? Because this topic is a, in fact, it's a common question in the WhatsApp when you get to SS3. Okay, so that is, it's just, is it like you raise your hand? Um, sir, I'm sure that, um, sir, um, there are some calls that are legal calls, sir. Calls that are legal calls? Okay, can you please explain? It's, um, sir, it's, uh, on that some code that, on, on that have been approved by the government. There's no code that's approved by the government. Hello? Please, all of you, listen. There's no code that have been approved by the government. Don't, don't worry, you will see, during the, under the means of preventing courtism, you will find out that anybody who is a courtist cannot hold public office. After this class, go and carry, your, carry out your research. If you are a courtist, you can't hold public office. Okay, there's no court, there's no court, there's no court, quote me again, I repeat about three times, that has government approval. Because there are different laws made by the government against courtesy. Please take note of that and get that out of your mind. Is that understood? Sir. Yes, um, sir. Um, sir, I still have a question, sir. Yes, I'm listening. Um, sir. Um, since the government know people are courtesy, sir, so why can't they arrest them? Government is arresting them. Okay, there are laws. If government make law, that means the law has been made in order to correct some things. Okay, since government made the law to correct some things, it means the government is also implementing it. Just that you buy with so many people, Joe Kalabi, do something that you buy here. Uh -huh. Some of you, some of you, you are the one that's not even helping the government. When you know that somebody is a courtist, you will not report. When you know a courtist in your area, you must report. That is one of your role. I think I taught you duties of a citizen. When you know court is or the court activity in your area, report to law enforcement agent. Government is not special, I will know everything that happened everywhere. Okay? When you know something like that, please and please inform the government. Government will act. Government does not tolerate uh, courtesy. Is that understood? You heard about Badu in Lagos State before. Who quenched Badu? Is it your government? I'm still with you. That 
you had a Barbados two years ago in Lagos State. Who yes, destroyed sir. who destroyed Bado? Is it you or government? Government, sir. Yeah, so you can you have answered your question yourself. So government is fighting against courtism. Okay. Leke. Where where are you? Okay. Okay, you have you have 10 seconds to ask your question. Okay, sir. What if you report them to the government and mm. they decide to take revengeful action? Like they try they try to revenge against you for they will not them. know. Thank you very much. They will not know. Mm? Those law enforcement agents too, they are human, they 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 have intelligence, they will not tell them, okay. But use your numbers anyway, all right. Use your numbers, but they will not tell them that you are the one that would they know that you are going they're going to report them. So that is just it. They won't know. All right? Help the government. The government cannot do it alone. We are we are fat. If we fail to do fulfill our role, the government will not work. Oh, please. Hmm? Thank you. Omotosha, what's your question? You Excuse have 10 me, seconds. Sir. 10 seconds. Mm -hmm. Okay, sir. So what if you got robbed and you don't want it to happen again? You now go to Babala or you went to get Juju, and um, but you will not kill the arm robber or anything, but you just don't make them enter the house. Is this so wrong? I have answered this question, Motoshop, please. Hmm? You get robbed, eh? You want to go and rob the person again, Abby? I said there's no reason you should go and meet. A, a, any 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 part that is not justifiable for any reason. Hmm? God will fight for you now. Somebody is asking what is Bado. Bado is a court in Lagos State around the Kuru that terrorist Kuru area. Some maybe about two years ago, when they will hit somebody's head and will take the blood and you and they, will go and, they will use it to make money. Okay. So what I'm saying in a sense is that you don't need you don't need to take blood to your hands. If we are robbed, government will, government will arrest those that rob you. If government will not arrest them, government will know how to arrest. So it is not of yours to go to any Bahabal list. Please. Saddam, I think I've answered your question. Uh, Divine, do you still have any question? Yes, sir. Okay, what is the question? In 10 seconds. Ah, you mute yourself again. I'll mute you. I'll mute you. So I don't have any questions. Okay, 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 okay. Lower your hand. Uh, Saddam, I think I've answered your question. So what if there's a traitor in the police force? The <laughs> government. Yes, yes, thank you. What you have said, you are correct. Hmm? Because you also have some bad head in the law enforcement agent at times. That's why I said the other time that you borrow yourself sense when you want to do that kind of thing. Hmm? Use common sense okay i'm not saying all the law enforcement are good and i'm sorry all of them are bad okay there are good ones there are bad ones too don't forget that among the among the 12 disciples that is where you have uh, judas is carrots and judas Carrot does not make that all the disciples of jesus christ to be bad okay it does not make the levels are still good so there are some that are still good give the information they know how to put, use the information and get the necessary action carried out okay so that is just it. So far, so good. We have been able to assess some reasons why people join court. And that's why I'm going to put it for today. By God's grace, we'll meet next week. And I'm going to set the question maybe by Friday to you for you to do. And those of that are not doing my assignment, you know yourself, make sure you do my assignment. Thank you very much. And God bless you. <laughs>